Now, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can actually add up all the numbers easily without a calculator. Now, this works on Google Sheets and as well as on Microsoft Excel. So I'm going to show you step by step how to do it like this. Hi, this is Neil Tan. Now, first of all, go to Google and search for Google Sheets. Go ahead and click on Google Sheets. Click on that. The next, you will be directed to this page. And this is where you need to click on Sign In. So once you click on Sign In, you will be directed to this page. Now, once you come to this page, you can go ahead and click on Blank. Now, first of all, as you can see, the table here. Here, you can see there's a total for the row and total for column. So the row is where I want to identify the team total sales for October, total sales for November, and total sales for December. And this column here is where I would like to know how much sales is Josh making for the past three months, and how much is Brian is doing, and Sarah, Jesse, and Billy as well. Now, first of all, I would like to get the total sales for the whole team for in October. So the formula that I'm going to insert is equal key in sum as you am and then i'm going to open bracket or the parentheses then here you can see it automatically appear you can just tap on enter on your keyboard tap on enter and then you can see this total amount will be automatically calculated then next will be november so i'm going to do the same thing for november but instead of key in manually by myself what i can do is i can just click on this fifteen thousand dollars which is b8 here you can see there is a small little square box here you can just click and drag it like this now you have the total sales for november and total sales for december okay so this is for the row results that how you can actually use the formula to calculate to get the total amount so that same goes for the column so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do the same thing, key in the same formula, which is equals sum, parenthesis, and you can see it will automatically highlight for these three months results by George. So all I'm going to do is on my keyboard, just tap on enter. And you can see that, you can see the price. It automatically sums up all the results for George. Now I'm going to do the same thing for the rest, for Brian, Sarah, Jesse, and Billy. Same thing, you can see there's a small little square blue box. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to hold it and I'm going to drag it down like this. And you can see it automatically sum up all the results just like this. And now I can know how much is George making for the past three months. The total is making 11,000. And for the entire team, all right, for December example would be 30,000. Now, this is a very simple uh, formula. Now, what if I have a long list of sales? All right, just like this. All right, as you can see here, I have about 40, okay, 40 people with different sales generated, different sales results. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to do the same thing as well. All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna key in like this. I'm gonna put here, example, it can be a total here, total. And here, I'm gonna key in equal sum, as you can see, it automatically highlights everything. So I'm going to just tap on Enter. So this is how you actually sum up all these results, just like the first one. Now, let's say if there are new sales coming in, all right, for some reason, you're getting results from your Google form or from other database, whether it's from your website or from the e-commerce store, and you have integrated to Google Sheets. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something like this. Okay, let me just show you. I'm going to key in equals sum, all right? And instead of putting all this, you know, from D2 to D41, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the number 41 and only remain D, okay? So it means that whenever there are new people or the same people with different sales results that is generated from our e-commerce store, it will automatically appear and the total sales over here will automatically calculate it. So let's just tap enter. You can see. Now if I were to key in, for example, $1,000, you can see it will add another $1,000 here. So if I were to do the same, you see, it will keep on increase. 
you see that you increase 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 all right so this is how you sum up all your data that you have it could be in terms of sales it could be in terms of the numbers of participants the number of registration and so on all right so i hope this helped if you like this video if you learn something new from this video please do subscribe to this channel like this video and do share to your social media so this is 101 and i'll see you in the next one